Alrighty. Ako ay si Mr. A. Okay. Nanonood. Haba. Sa Pinoy PC Perspective video. This is a special video. Uh, hindi nyo makikita pero ito ang makikita nyo. Uh, this is a uh, Everest 80 plus 600 watt power supply. Uh, binili ko ito kanina lang. And uh, I'm gonna show you. I'm uh, gonna show you how to on. And actually, kung anong contents na ito, uh, nabili ko siya sa PC Express. It cost 3,350 pesos. And uh, mukha siyang uh, kakaiba because we haven't seen uh, FSP group here. Hindi natin alam kung saan yan. Pero it, uh, from research, it seems na galing siya sa isang prominent Taiwan company. And actually, nasabi ko nga in my Pinoy PC Perspective podcast episode 6 na... Uh, should I say this na tier 1 siya uh, tier 1 manufacturer so uh, ang FSP FSP ay gumagawa ng mga iba-ibang power supply from other manufacturers I have research on that but anyway uh, if you look carefully in the box sinasabi rito na from uh, Tom's Hardware there's a uh, seal na uh, Overdrive means that it is designed or it can also be designed to be overclocked. Uh, you see the box is uh, ito yung mga kanyang connectors. The usual 20 plus 4 pin plus 4 for the uh, new motherboards or actually the latest motherboards. 8 4 pin. Uh, this one is for uh, to know. <laughs> PCI Express for sa mga video card, serial SATA, as usually, smart molex, I have no idea with that, sleeve mesh cables, and the other stuff. It says here efficiency 85 watts, hindi ko may uh, be measure to but according to uh, some sources like Anantec, it does do what the uh, what it says. Super quiet, we haven't seen that, I'll test it later, then that's it. Open it up. Mm -hmm. Here it is. Uh, Binili ko is modular. So as you can see. Uh, let say this. Uh, one thing na hindi ko pa pala may express in video is, is this is a heavy uh, power supply. Mukhang mabigat siya. Actually it's hard to carry. Uh, modular to. As you can see. Here's the... Uh, Here's the additional cables, uh, as you can see. Pwede siyang, pwede mong itagdag. Uh, here's the 4-pin uh, Molex here. Some peripheral cables, as you can see, medyo very well made siya. Copper mesh, as said. Serial ADA cables. 8-pin for uh, very high-end power graphics cards. 6-pin for traditional cards. Here it is. Uh, this one, ito yung uh, uh, parang built-in. So, actually, in-expect ko hindi siya ano. Uh, I thought it's, well, but it's modular. It's as, as is everybody, lahat ng cables ay removed. But it seems not. So, mm -hmm. Let me get this out. Uh, oh yeah, as you can see, uh, okay, bang. this is a blue, color blue as you can see. FSP group, here's a logo. Here's the... Uh, uh, specs. Usually they're... It's quite, quite detailed kung tutusin. It has a 575 watts, 80% I guess if computed. Uh, it's kakaiba rin. Uh, usually the power supply sits below the PCB but it seems that it's hanging upside down. As you can see, galito siya. Actually, maglalagay mo. That's the on and off. So, it, it seems lead so it will turn on. Okay, 4 pin, here it is, 4 pins, and there's also another set of 6 pins, wala yung peripheral cable, so you'll have to add that later. Alright, 
it here and dito yung mga extra cables you want to put <laughs> okay then ito here's the uh, components inside so makikita nyo yan so it says the fan is quiet uh, we'll test that later you can see here it is this logo okay now Uh, this here also has a uh, of course cable uh, so uh, what's this ah ito yung uh, when pan trim sticker and a pot of screws para sa mounting there's a manual mm -hmm. I'll read this later so there you go yan ang uh, Boxing ng Everest 600 power plus. Now let's connect it up.